What do you think the Lions are going to do in the draft after watching last night's game? Do you think they'll look at Philadelphia and say, hey, wow, they had a great defense, but guess what? Kansas City still put up almost 40 points on them. So what have you been talking about what to do in the draft? Offense, offense. Yeah, the Lions could have played last night. You know why? They could have gave up 38 points, and they might have scored 41 points. I'm just saying. Offense wins right now in today's game. You're not going to stop Patrick Mahomes. He scored on every single yep. drive in the second yep. half. One incomplete pass was a throwaway. You're not going to stop him, but I'll damn what. You're not going to stop us either. We're going we're gonna to punch you right in your face every single time right back at you. Go offense this draft. I'm with you. My thing all along, Braylon, has been take what you do the best and make it better. If you can do that, I think you can play in every single football game you play in. You can. And, you know, whether it's Bryce Young, C.J. Stroud, or Anthony Richardson, those two quarterbacks last night really highlighted the fact that I'm not sure you can go all the way with Jared Goff. I, I, I Just watching those two quarterbacks last night... <clears throat> And their seventh round running backs. The only reason they got seventh round running backs is because they got two future Hall of Famers at quarterback. Yeah, you know they got on, on rookie deals, by the way. Uh, so whether it's Isaiah Pacheco in the seventh round, your running back, it's pretty good. Or you got uh, the boy, he got Kenneth, Kenneth Gainwell. Is that even his name? Yeah, it is. Uh, Kenneth Gainwell. I mean, Kenny Gainwell and Boston Scott could have won you, you got some money. Nobody, I mean. Take Anthony Richardson, take B. John Robinson, and be done with it. Make what you do great even greater. That's how you compete in today's NFL. I'm absolutely, absolutely okay with drafting a quarterback. Because I've always said Jared Goff is not going to win your Super Bowl.